can you tell me what your name is? Lucy. And where are you from? Uh, Scotland. <laughs> uh, do you like reading? Yeah, yeah, I do like reading. I don't. I've not read a, a lot recently, but. <laughs> uh, what is your opinion on indie published books? On what published books? Indie, indie independently published books. Um, I think it takes like a lot for an independently published book to do well. Um, but quite often they can be quite interesting. And else? Um, have, you, have you ever read an independently published book? Um, not that I can think of. Would you like to try one? <laughs> um, yeah. 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 I I find it difficult to find a book that I'm interested in at the moment. Um, I don't know. I feel like they're all really cliche and not really um don't have anything really about them. Um, I feel like obviously an independently published book might have something different that all these well-known authors or might not have, I guess. What kind of uh, books do you like? What genres do um, I quite like mystery and I like, um, I don't know, like fantasy books. Yeah. What's your favourite author? If you've got a favourite book. A favourite author. Mm, I'm trying to think who I've read. Well, I. When I was younger, I read all of like I know they're like both big authors, but like the, uh, the Narnia Chronicles and like obviously Harry Potter classics. But um, I can't really think. I've honestly not read in so long. I just don't have time for work. Oh, thank you so much. No, I'm uh, Georgina. I'm from Rochdale. Uh, do you like reading? Um, I used to. I used to read quite a lot, but I've stopped doing it now. What kind of books do you used to like to read? Um, I used to quite like reading quite sort of scary things, I guess. I used to like I used to love reading like Stephen King, and I used to love like English literature at school and things like that. But as I got older, I sort of just stopped and. I sort of more read, I guess, like non-fiction books now. Yeah. Yeah, we go through phases. Okay? Yeah. <laughs> we binge like fiction, and then we go through non-fiction. Um, what's your opinion on indie published books? On independent in published books. Um, it's, I mean, have you ever tried one or what? I know. I don't think I have really. Uh, no. Would you like to try one or? Do you yeah, I guess so. Yeah. I'd be like, I think because I like haven't like um, read in like a long time I'd be like open to anything really yeah I just yeah I quite like the idea of it really because you might find like new people who you've never heard of it's like music I guess like the same like finding bands no one else has heard of and things like that uh, what's your favorite book if you could pick one from like what you've read so far uh, it's kind of obvious but probably like The Shining Stephen King I know it's a bit obvious but it is my favourite book that I've read. Thank you so much. It's okay.
I'm from, I'm, name's Dean and I'm from St. Helens. Uh, so do you like reading? Yeah. What kind of books do you like reading? Um, I'm currently reading a Star Wars book at the minute. Um, called Alphabet Squadron. Um, uh, what's your opinion on indie publishing books? Uh, good, because it's good for the creators that create them. Um, Have you recently read one? Or I haven't, no. no? I've read... Uh, like indie comics and graphic novels. Oh, that's awesome. Which, do you have any that come to your mind now? Uh, I can't think off the top of my head now. <laughs> okay, thank you so much. Okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> so if you could uh, please tell me what your name is and where you're from. I'm Holly and I'm from Manchester. Uh, do you like reading? Yeah. What kind of books do you like to read? Um, I like like um sort of like political books. Like I like George Orwell quite a lot. So 1984. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, what's your favourite book in general? Um, what's your I think The Handmaid's Tale is probably my favourite. What do you think of the adaptation? It's good, it's really good. Did you good. see the last episode? Yeah, yeah, I'm yeah, it, yeah. it? it was hard. It was a bit, uh, <laughs> yeah. um, what's your opinion on indie published books? Have you read one? Or um, probably not, but I would. Yeah, you would? Yeah. yeah. Well, um, so you said political books. Do you like scary books as well? Like, uh, not really, no. Uh, no. Yeah, it's okay. <laughs> Thank you so much. It's alright. <laughs> <laughs> Where would this go? Uh, on my YouTube channel. Okay. <laughs> okay. Um, so, what is your name and where you're from? Uh, my name's Jenny and I live in Hebden Bridge. Uh, do you like reading? Yes. What kind of books do you like to read? Mostly fiction. What, what genre? Oh, anything. Um, I'm in a book group and so we kind of pass each other books around. That's awesome. Um, what's your opinion on indie published books? Um, I'm happy to read them. It's just really hard to get hold of them, so yeah, it's only really when you get it's kind of word of mouth. Um, what's your favourite book you've read so far? Traditionally or independent Um I'd say Barbara Kingsolver is my favourite author. Barbara Kingsolver. Yeah, I think that's it. It's okay. Um <laughs> Do you think any of the preconceptions about in the public books are true? Like some people say they're not as good as other books or Well I, I think there's a whole culture in the publishing industry to have certain standards and certain kind of ways of doing things and so I think that does produce quality but that doesn't mean that quality can't be found elsewhere as well. Thank you very much. Okay. <laughs>